welcome to another episode of Tell Extra 2005, the Peter Till season. It's time for the Spartan Battle at round number three at the Greek Isles. Probably the hardest course in the game for me. I feel like I do better at Paradise Cove and Emerald Dragon, even though they're meant to be harder, I think. Yeah. Either way, let's get on with it. The Greek Isles, much like the country it resides in, is rich in history. If the pros study their history, they'll know they're in for a tough day on this challenging course. Well known for chewing up the best in the world, the Greek Isles is a course for the ages. I'm Gary McCord along with David Faraday for EA Sports. Welcome to round three of this PGA Tour event at Greek Isles. Right then. We've got to be careful on this hole. We don't want to use the target vision straight away. But if you don't get it close, you have to because the green is a nightmare. Oh, he's got all that one. Just crushed it down the fairway. There we are. That's about the best we could do with that. Moving a 16 yard drive to a flat part of the fairway. Oh, for goodness sake. Okay. Oh, that's gone left and short. Stop, 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 stop. Oh, I don't know about that. Line it up and train it. No problem over yeah, Tiger Vision News, it's an impossible green, not a lot you can do about it. You've got to get lucky and you get it close. 34 under. Not a good start. Not a good start. Cut between two clubs and I pay the price. The Tiger Vision, anyway. Once again, 55 or under is the target. Good at last time, thanks to a big help from a hole in one. Without that, it would have been touch and go until the end. Whoa. Don't want to land a hole in one this time. 55 yards the into the know, wind. This is a tough no chance. You know, like 300 yards and something else left of the hole, please. You know, I'm glad I'm an Play it onto the fairway. Lay it up. What do you see, David? About 140 left here. To the left side, the wind will help stop that, I'm hoping. Yeah, that'll do. Close approach. Power was spot on, the wind didn't, didn't do too much, sending it back to the right though. Probably should have aimed that straight at the hole more or less. But it is an easy birdie. It is an easy birdie, we'll take it. The less we have to use the target, target visions the better. Uh, this one that should be a par five, quite frankly. This one, okay, hit it high in the air. Over the, we have to get past this turn effectively. Oh, had a lot of power on that. I hit that a bit more left than I planned on the on the analog stick. It stays in play. This one's going to have to travel some distance, David. Yeah, I'd say it's about 240 yards to the hole. Down the hill against the wind, though, we'll hit a normal two iron. Bit of power boost and spin it towards the hole. Shot. Oh, that's gone well, right? What happened there? Keep going. I don't know why I went so far to the right. For oh, it's one of those. But really? Left edge? It Yeah, that looks straight to me. I put that a little left and it ended up a little left. If anything, that needed to be to the right. I think it was a straight putt because it breaks left and back right, so it put me off there. The par three, four, the Never look, oh, there's a hole at the back. This one's harder if it's at the back because you have to clear the slope this time. If you don't clear the slope, you're in trouble. I'm going to play a power boost to four iron and be a bit aggressive here. I think a three iron goes over. Goes over. This could be headed for the green. All right, it's in the rough, but I had to do that. It's going to hit the slope. It was going to hit the slope there. Just get it past the slope. It's an easy enough put. There we go. Oh no, that was a straight put. I thought it was breaking left. And we're playing sloppy here. We're playing sloppy. We're in for a bad day. 
It's that simple. Big improvement needed if we want to get the 55 target. Simple as that. Can't mess up on the par 3. That's the easiest par 3 as well, and that's poor. That's poor. Right. Let's make it up for it. Let's go. Oh, crap. Oh, just over the trees. Bit lucky there. We'll take it. It is a, a, a bit of a look. I just want this event to be done. I hate the Greek Isles. Okay, okay, okay. Three wood here. Three wood. Took a little bit of power out of that. Go on. Oh, yeah, that's a good shot. This is going to be an easy eagle. Our only realistic eagle chance of the day. And we're going to get it. There we go. 38 under for the championship. Nine under par. No. No, I'm five under par for the day because of the last par. Five through five. Okay. Sixth hole is a par for. Let's go. Right down the middle. Nice swing. We want to get as close as to the rough as possible without being in the rough. It's still like a two to three iron on this shot. I'll play a three iron. Looks to be right on the money there. Nice shot. Better front spin. Oh, I'll stay right from the hole. But that's a good shot. Get much better than a bit of less spin, maybe. But for now, I'm left edge. Bit of power. Into the cut. Let's keep going. Hole seven. Hole seven, we don't have time for this. This one's a tough hole. We're going to try and blast it down the left side. The wind will blow it back towards the middle. What a drive. Thanks for exactly what we have planned. That is a 357 yard drive. It's this shot that's tough. It's uphill, but you, you overhit this a little bit. You are stuffed. I've gone for this one. I've played quite aggressive here. Play quite aggressive. Ooh, that's not bad at all. It's a good shot. I'm trying to preserve these tiger visions. I'm being a tad more aggressive here now. After the part. I'm gonna make up for it if I can. Par three coming up. This par three is relatively straight. Yeah, it's this par three. Through iron. Ho hopefully the wind is the wind's done nothing. Put a front spin. Good roll. We might get away with that one, but the wind did nothing there. There we go. We get the birdie. Yeah, the wind can be quite inconsistent sometimes. Oh well. The ninth hole is an There's just. Well, wind is against it. That's not great because we have to play it to the left side here. We need all the power boosts we can get, or we're in the rough. Let's go. That'll do it. That will do it. Left side as well, where it's a little bit flatter. Almost 200 yards to the green from here, David. Man, until right second shot, not be an easy shot. Uphill into the wind. Looking good. Let's get it on the green. I'll have to do, I think. Give it enough room on the left, and this will fall off. Target vision will be used here. Secure the birdie. Yeah, I'm not sure if I want to use a target vision there, but I had to though. I want the birdie. I'm going to use it when I need it. So we'll see what happens. The stunning tenth hole allows for long drives down the fairway. It allows for long drives, which means we're going to go for the long drive. Although I think this might be one where I get caught between two clubs. He smashed that one. I hooked that a bit to the left actually on the analog stick. From the middle of the fairway, out of the way of the trees. Can't run at that one. Perfect position here to hit nine iron. Nice 
Nice swing. Should be safely on the green. Oh, I did do too much there. Ah, uh, that's gonna be a tough little putt, actually. This for six birdies in a row. Target vision used again. We're in danger here. We are in danger. Some of these greens are ridiculous. I say that every time I play the Greek Isles, but it is true. All right, let's keep going. We need some good approach shots now. We can't be getting sloppy with these. You're more than three feet out. The target vision might have to be used. That's how bad it is sometimes. Uh oh. What is he thinking about here? It's fine. Yeah, it's fine. We're through the tree. Looks to be about We're just about got away with it. Wow. Was that a guess? You're about right. He knows this is a good shot. Stop it, Dad. Oh, That'll do it. That's a good shot. Three feet. This would be seven straight birdies if it goes in. I mean, look at that pot, though. Seriously. What am I supposed to do with that? So that's like a vision news. That's insane. That's how I'm three feet out and look out. Look, look at that. Well, the target vision was completely wrong, wasn't it? Oh, that was a complete bloody waste. What was that? I should have just put, took a little bit of power out of it and just whacked out the hole. Target vision completely wrong. Last one goes to complete and utter waste. Thanks, game. Right. That's annoying me. Let's go. Don't be surprised, McCord, if this catches the rock. Oh, that's over hit. That's over hit. The left, the right spin saves it. The right spin saves it. We're gonna go for it again, even though we never get there, but we'll try. Might get a dicey uh, it's gonna play onto the hill again. We'll pitch it with a sandwich. Oh, I was hoping for more roll than that. I mean, we can make that, but it's a little tough little putt. Oh man! This is some of the worst putting. Oh, I've shut up, commentator. There we are. Escape with par, but the 55 is looking dicey. It's a sloppy performance. And the Greek Isles could do with an earth, I'm just saying. There's no way you can play that well on this course. It's just stupid. The, amazing the greens are ridiculous, man. Outrageous. Nothing wrong with this approach. Yeah, that'll do. I think it's up a hill, but that's pretty much it. Yeah. Whack it. There we go. 11 under through 13, not great. I'm not happy with that. I'm not happy with that at all. As I bang my desk for no reason there, as I move about. I'll be glad when this one is done. Alright. Let's go. I wish I could hit the ball this far. Twenty and forty eight yards arrived. Over the trees. A really good looking shot. That's here. right at the hole. That's right at the hole. Oh witnessed a truly remarkable shot. That was nearly in. That was nearly in. Alright, four holes to go. Come on. End this nightmare. The June 18 is almost... Is, I mean, the June 18 is the worst one, but this isn't far, be, far behind it. The June 18 is bad because it, you're on the bully target to use. I didn't get all of it, lad. I've been sending the power boost in the bottom right. That's 252 yards, man. What's the distance, David? Looks to be about Commentator's clueless. Yards, the flag stick. 
Let's play a shot. This should find the green. Yeah, Sam Westwick just play a super shot. Third consecutive birdie. We need a good putt here. Tough putt. Tough putt. Grace is the edge. And I think the 55 dream is over. I think the 55 dream is over. Three, well, four, seven, nine. Yeah, that'd be a 57. Yeah, the 55 dream is well over. It's been a sloppy display. But look at the AI is easy in this game. To be honest with you. We need a miracle for the 55. I think we need three. We need a hold in one and two eagles. Good luck getting that on these. Well, this one, this one's not impossible because it's a flat green. But right, it always plays short. It always plays short. It always plays short. Go on. Oh, I should have just left that. That's where you can get it in, because if you get it in line with the hole, it's a straight it's a straight putt. So with enough spin, you can just send it straight into the hole, because it's completely flat at the front. Put two holes together. The 55 Dream is over. We can at least try and get a hole in one again. And again, on this hole, oh my god, yeah, this is hard. He's hit this really well. Down the slope. Bar the hole. Stay. Look again, McCord. This is in the rough. We're going to get close to the hole. That's all we can do there. So you can really do it. Sometimes being in the rough isn't that bad. There we go. We'll take that. We'll take that. Yeah, not the best performance. We'll live with it. We're still beating the AI by a few shots. The, the problem is you can drive that, but then you're screwed because you can't hit it over the trees. So you got to play it short. That should work out nicely. You're better off playing it to the, to the left edge on this first part of the fairway. Oh, hit every ferry at least, apparently. There's that. I'm going to be aggressive here. Makes a fairway alright. No, that'll do. That'll do. Oh, for goodness, that was a slope there. Oh, we're just going to get it over and get the path. For goodness sake, this game, I hate this game. I hate this course. I'm just going to pitch it over. And get it on the floor. Because if I under-hit that, it's, it's rolling all the way back down and you're screwed. Oh, where's the target vision when I freak? Oh, this is terrible. There's nothing I can do. The hole's just in a stupid position. It really is. Just sort of game. I hate this course. Just get it over with. Get it over with. Six to a beat the AI one. Just move on. I'm in a bad mood now. Just put me in a bad I hate this course. It's a stupid course. You can't put on those greens. You cannot put on those greens. Who would design his course? He's a slap in the face. Okay, that kid, but yeah, screw that hole. It's a stupid course. Next time it's over and done with, thankfully. We'll move on to like a standard course that I can actually play on. Uh, right, well, that's that for now. Thank you very much for watching. I know we'll see you next time. So let's play Tags for 2005, BJ Tour season.